Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you what I learned off of another YouTuber's video, but he has no sound. He like did one of those tutorials where you type it in inside a notepad. So I'm going to teach you how to texture mod inside of Combat Arms with sound. So there will be a link in the description, download it and you'll get a folder like this, it's going to say Res Hacker. Open that up and open up this file, Res Extract. Go to File, Open to Extract. Alright, now you're going to scroll down until you get Guns underscore T underscore. And T stands for Texture. And the M stands for Model. Don't open the M, open the T's. I'm going to mod a Assault Rifle. Extraction completed. Now we can exit out of this. And this is going to make a new file inside of our Combat Arms directory. So if I go to Nexon, Combat Arms, Game Folder, Game Folder, we're going to have this new folder in here Guns, Texture, Assault Rifle. And these are all the assault rifles in the game. Now we're going to open up DTX Converter, go to File, Open Folder. <coughs> and my computer, my C hard drive, Nexon don't know what I just did, Nexon, Combat Arms, Game and open up this folder we just made highlight that click OK then this is going to be two buttons, well three, clear, convert to Nexon and convert to lift deck if you look under the type, they're all next on now. That makes it so Combat Arms can read the file. We're going to um, convert to list text so Photoshop can read these. Now, it's time to... Well, let me minimize all this stuff to get it out of the way. Get that all out of the way. Alright. So, now we have the files in list tech mode. If you look inside of here, you go to Plugins file formats there's going to be a file in here so what we're going to do is go into our photoshop folder so we can open up the res files let's see which folder is it I have my entire photoshop thing down here so photoshop cs4 portable app Photoshop, go into plugins, file formats, and drag this DTX format in there. Now look for hmm, the README file, and you got to get these two DLL files. What we're doing is adding to Photoshop, like here's one of them and once you get those you just drag those into not this folder but you go back into your main Photoshop folder which is right here so just click on Photoshop it's in that folder app Photoshop and just drag these two DLL files into there I don't think they're inside of the uh, downloads so you gotta search your computer for them just go to here and search it in So now that Photoshop's ready to read the DTX files, we can close out of this folder for now. Leave this open and open up photo, uh, Photoshop. Get a drink real fast while I'm waiting. Trying to do this fast for the um, 10 minute rule on YouTube. File, open, go to my computer my combat arms directory the game folder the folder we just made guns texture assault rifles I'm gonna open up my M16 A3 and I'm gonna use that really really high oh yeah I forget I already modded that one uh, I'll do another file for an example I'll mod my scar L tips are you can mod any file you want in here Alright, so this is what we're going to get. 
I'm gonna go ahead and grab my brush tool. You can get really specific, but since I'm on time restrictions, I'm gonna uh, speed this up quite a bit. I'm gonna go to swatches and select uh, blue. Make a new layer. I'll do it in red, white, and blue, I guess. Red, white, and gray, because uh, white doesn't show up. It just makes the picture lighter. All right, now unless you want your gun looking like this, we got to go to the um, I'll say normal right here. Just change that to overlay, which is gonna give us this really cool effect. File, save as, and select a DTX format. Now you're gonna click save. It's gonna ask you, do you want to replace the already existing file? Just click OK to that. OK. This takes a second. Alright, there we go. Now I'm going to go in here and click convert to Nexon again. Then you can exit out of there, go back into our res hacker, and use the res inject. Now since we're dealing with a assault rifle, we're going to go back to our combat arms directory, and select guns, textures, Assault rifles. Add a file, uh, which is the Tipsar we just worked on. It's right here, Scarl Tipsar. Go ahead and open that up and inject that. Make sure the status is OK. Inject it. Injection completed. OK. Exit out of that. Exit out of here. Shut the fuck up! I'm making a video. Sorry. My computer, we gotta go back into our combat arms directory. And this part is really easy and it's the last step. There's gonna be two files here. There's gonna be a guns texture, assault rifle, guns texture, assault rifle, res new. Delete the old one. Right click on this, rename it, and just Take the new off of there. If you change file name extensions, it may cause it to be unstable. It's not going to. Just click yes to that, and you'll get it like this. You can exit out of here now. Load up Combat Arms. And that's it. It's really simple. I guess I'll throw in some screenshots of what the gun looks like now.